From Elon Musk and OpenAI at odds to a big call by NVIDIA's boss, this is Generation AI. OpenAI is biting back at Elon Musk. The billionaire was a co-founder of the ChatGPT maker, but now he's suing it, saying it has abandoned its mission to develop AI for the good of all humanity. OpenAI says it will seek to dismiss all Musk's claims and noted that the legal action comes after he started a rival AI outfit of his own. U.S. stocks have soared to new record highs, powered by another rally for AI-related firms. The gains saw chipmaker NVIDIA close above $2 trillion in market value for the first time. Simplify Asset Management Chief Strategist Michael Green says investors are ditching a broader market focus to plow money into hot names. I just suggest that people are now basically trying to say, I get the joke, this is all about AI, and that in turn becomes self-reinforcing as people put more money to work in these names, drives their prices higher, drives even further sentiment shifts. An AI-assisted robot surgeon was among the tech on show at the MWC Tech Fest in Barcelona. Its makers say the technology helps overcome the big limitation of remotely operated surgery for doctors. So with our new artificial intelligence tools, we provide again this sensorial feedback to the surgeon, so the surgeon, they could feel when they are touching the, 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 the tissues. NVIDIA boss Jensen Huang says AI will probably be able to pass all human tests in around five years. Right now, the tech can already pass challenges like legal exams, but struggles with things like specialized medical questions. And Dell is feeling the AI effect. The computer maker says the technology is driving a boom in demand for its servers. It says AI will also help drive a rebound in demand for PCs over the longer term.